I think there's a delight in the perception and the enjoyment of objects. Objects are there only if you really see them. If you don't, they don't exist. And art is to some effect trying to make others see what you see. For 35 years, Jay Maisel has been showing us his extraordinary vision of the world. He was someone that we all looked up to. He was an idol. Jay's images invariably seem to say, stop and look at this. It was the summer of 1979. I took an internship with a photographer named Jay Maisel. Jay's home in his studio was a six-story, 36,000-square-foot former bank on Spring Street in the Bowery. When I heard that this building had changed my life and the man who shaped it were moving on, I immediately knew I had to capture Jay's world before it disappeared. Each floor represented a certain partition of his mind. He had more junk than I did. Everything that I was there was useless. They're estimating 35 truckloads to get out of here. He sees all these potential in things that no one else would think of. He just has such a sense of play. What I'm trying to do all the time is to try and see things anew. To see things the way a child would see them. It's like, here comes the world, and I'm trying to get it as it comes towards me. I wanted a place that I would have roots. And this was this building. I had always planned to die here, but I can't. I'm trying to look at it as an adventure. He was an artist of his generation, a philosopher, and the greatest teacher I ever had. We do not take pictures. We're taken by pictures.